Yo, what's up? It's your boy, IT. Yeah, and I'm here with... No, no, I'm here with... <laughs> I'm bugging. <laughs> I'm about to watch this video, man. Jada Pickett Smith just won't stop embarrassing Will Smith. Let's check it out. Females. So at this point, it seems like Jada Pinkett Smith's attempts to embarrass her husband and herself, for that matter, are never going to end. Years ago, this couple was looked up to with admiration by many as an example of a good relationship. J. Cole even had his now infamous line about wanting that Jada and that Will love. But these days, that seems much more like a curse than a blessing on all accounts. I mean, at this point, it's almost like saying you want that Adam and that Lena love. That's just nasty. Because ever <laughs> That's since crazy work right there. Crazy came work. out and said he was smashing Jada in Will's very own home, things have really never been the same for this entire family. I actually sat down with Will and had a conversation. He gave me his blessing. And I, I totally and what you gave this? myself to... Is that 2016? No, I don't think, I think that was recent. No, That's when he came out as um, gay. Yeah, yeah. 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 So like that 2022? We know other than yeah. the Fresh Prince himself. I felt like it was important to come to the table to really clear the air. Where Will sat there and looked like a kid whose puppy just escaped from their backyard as his wife not only confirmed these rumors, but That's also bad. made sure it's everyone hard. knew that she thoroughly enjoyed, in her words, what was an entanglement with one of her son's friends. We actually became really, really Really good friends. Mm -hmm. I just wanted to feel good. Mm -hmm. It had been so long mm -hmm. since I felt good. So and leave that nigga. Really a joy Shit. to just help heal somebody. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Great edit. Really been the Funny. same because yeah, he really is. got knocked off this pedestal of being like an icon and a borderline legend to being someone who is now kind of seen as a joke you know this guy kind of turns into an internet meme i love my baby i'm gonna stand by my baby no matter what we ride together we, we die, die together, together. No, fuck bad that. marriage have you ever seen anything like this before he's love to give ads bro i love to give. i get a drink you gotta pay the rent the main culprit in aiding in this humiliation ritual has been Tupac, who obviously Jada was very close to in her adolescence. Oh, and this sense, is a man bro. she has described time and time again as her soulmate gone too soon. She shared love letters from this man. She always talks about how much she misses him, how she talks to his ghost. And recently it's been just kind of more the same. In this latest edition of What Will She Do Next, Will had posted this picture on her birthday two weeks ago where he says, Happy birthday, mamita. I've been to 28 of your birthday parties. I don't know if we're ever going to top the one that Rakim performed at, but here's to a lifetime of trying. Hashtag walking each other home. Now, obviously, with the current state of the internet and how many people like to clown on this relationship, Will had to turn off the comments for this post. Damn. He also shared <laughs> pictures Damn. from her. Uh, this nigga can't just, he can't stop taking L's. The events that, you know, he threw for her where she's performing with Rakim and just in general having a good time, kind of just something you would see from a husband. Hey, she she still looked good back in the day though. Of course, yeah. yeah. Where the embarrassment really she, she still looks good. She still looks good, still good yeah. Before we yeah. come yeah. out. Yeah. A couple of days later, Jada hopped on her own Instagram to share this excerpt from her upcoming memoir where she talks about Tupac and how much he meant to her. Not in a million years would I have dreamed that the Fresh Prince and I would become um, very acquainted. Not in a million years did I imagine three lives, three fates would be so intertwined. And the three lives that she's talking about reason. there is her, Will, and Tupac. I mean, that's like your girl coming up to you and saying, hey, you know, you, me, and my ex, who Perfect. I always call my soulmate. Yeah, it's like we're in this weird throttle where we are going to yep. exist forever. Can you guys imagine just the sick feeling in your stomach? Just the level of disrespect is already off the charts. And yeah, I never crazy. would have imagined that this video would be well, the best friend, but friend, but of the last time. Not best friend, he used to fuck her. We used to fuck her. Simply kids yeah. That's not best friend. So yeah, like yeah. I said, that was I just say that. What's the big deal? Like, 
coming October 17th. And just a little side Oh, they got a book coming. Yeah. The, uh, all right. Cover. That's why all this shit coming out of the Reminds you a lot of that picture ah. of the baby where they say his head looks like a nah, multi that's cruiser. Crazy. And here's it's where the level of disrespect kind of just reaches an all time high. I'm sure a lot of you guys were wondering hey, I wonder what they were dancing to. I wonder what they were singing along to. And the song that the they're Fresh performing song, here yeah. is no other than one of Will Smith's very first hits. Look Parents right, just don't understand. The irony, bro. The irony, like bro. One of my fondest memories with this guy ever, who I love so much, who I can never forget about. You know, I'm so in the Matrix, bro. Was dancing along to my husband's song with him. Can you imagine when Will goes in the car, he throws on the phone, he puts his own songs on mix, and this shit comes on? I mean, I'm sure it has his ass wanting to swerve into the nearest tree. Like, I wonder if some point she will ever actually read the room or if she just kind of thoroughly enjoys embarrassing him in this she way. She just don't give like, a I fuck. Get that they were best That's friends. all it is. Okay. I get that they she were just don't lovers, give. But at some point, it's like, the guy has been dead for almost 30 years. Like, I don't care who you are, you cannot compete with the dead man. Like, recently, I was watching the newest True. season of Love is Blind on Netflix. And there's this contestant named Johnny. Okay, she had a couple connections in there. There was a couple guys feeling her. That is until she breaks out this story about this ex-boyfriend who ended up ODing. She starts crying, saying, oh, he was the only man I ever loved. I've never truly been able to get over him. Oh, and by the way, I was also married one other time. This bald guy is in there. He's like... So you're saying you got married to someone who wasn't the guy who OD'd. So you got married to someone who you didn't actually love. And this girl was like, oh yeah, that Females was just are complicated, kind of like bro. a rebound marriage. To which the guy, <sighs> much like Mark Cuban, replies, I'm out. And you guys might have been wondering, well, what is Will Smith doing in the midst of all of this drama? Well, apparently he's going on a date with a robot. I mean, I guess you can say that Will definitely <gasps> has a type. This is looking a lot like Jaden. And I don't really understand why they're trying to normalize this whole I AI robot that. thing so badly. Giving them faces, having them show up in the stands at various football games. Like, I think it's only so that was a good promo. one of good these promo. sick, lonely still need to watch that movie. marries one of these robots. Like, it'll be officially recognized in the court of law. Keep my robot's name out your, your fucking, fucking mouth. mouth. There's actually <laughs> a clip of Tupac and Jada, I believe this is from uh, the old TV show, A Different World. And it really is quite prophetic. Maybe I'll be down to scoop you up later in life. You ain't on. Uh, scoop you up later in life. <laughs> be like Ozzy Davis and Ruby D. Hey, you know you always got a place in my heart. And that seems to be the She really meant that shit. That was meant that, 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 that was in the script. That wasn't acting right now. That wasn't acting. This is from the from the heart. Right. From the heart. Apparently in association with the murder of Tupac and Jada of course had to chime in with her take via Instagram where she says now we can get some answers and have some closure rest in peace Pac and this guy they arrested by the way just kind of a big dummy he professed time and time again in various interviews throughout the years that he pretty much had at least some association with his death but that's really another topic for another video. Y'all let me know what you guys think about this continual embarrassment down below. It's almost like every time the season changes, something new happens for Will. Always. But as always, I do want to thank you guys for watching today's video, dropping a like and subscribing. But as you guys know, it's been your boy, the Tan Superman, and some other embarrassing celebrities out here need to be covered. So I'm out. Peace. We ride Great. together. We, we die, die together. together. Bad, Bad marriage, marriage for, for life. <laughs> That's crazy. Now the reason we we watched this video because there's a interview that just came out with Jada saying that she and Will Smith basically separated, mm -hmm. not legally, but separated uh, since 2016. So I know there's gonna be a lot of videos about this, so we about to watch all of them. We're gonna be eating it for sure, for sure, for sure. Rinse, rinse or do, rinse or do. Anyway, on to the next video.